Yes, good morning guys. Welcome to Water Process and Engineering Services. If you have been not yet subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel guys. Welcome to Water Process. Okay, once again, welcome to Water Process and Engineering Services. Today, we're going to talk about uh, our confirmed projects which is uh, confirmed to us by our client and we're going to talk about uh, our design because uh, in our transaction today or in this transaction should I say we're, we're going to build a new water refilling station so basically this is the this is the place Okay, this is the area to be uh, constructed by the water filling station. See, so this is the area. It's a corner lot, corner lot with uh, front frontage barangay road. So this is the area. So we we'll talk about the. The distance or the area that is uh, required by the Department of Health. So the area is supposed to be five meters by five meters, but as we measured this area, this portion and this portion is uh, not fitted with uh, five five meters, so. From here, from this area, corner, up to this area is not 5 meters, it's only uh, uh, three, 3 to 4 meters. <coughs> Excuse me. So we're lacking of uh, 1 meter, but, but uh, the other portion from here up to the back portion is uh, 5 meters uh, to uh, five, 5 to 6 meters. So and this area is uh, can be uh, installed with uh, the water station, but it is not uh, required. The, the the area that is required by the Department of Health uh, is not achieved. So, but this still can be uh, accommodated with the water station. So let's move on. Let's proceed to the the designing of the water station. So the basically this is a minimalist style. So it's a very simple uh, four corners of uh, the water station with uh, tiled frontage and half concrete and and uh, light metal wall using the hard flex and the metal studs and metal firing for the light wall with fixed glass at the frontage so that's it so this is the corner look this is the corner look of the filling station so a lot of uh, fixed glass in order to be, be to be visible from the outside customers so this is the half concrete so this is the existing wall but we need to plaster this one and uh, demolish the half portion and turn into uh, so, uh, fixed glass so this is where with the uh, receiving area or well, it can be here receiving a sliding door and this one is for the releasing whichever the customers is 
uh, or the client is convenient. So that's it. With Hardiflex fascia board uh, to be considered as uh, the signage with wool cladding here. That's it right here on water process and engineers. This is a suggestion in fish water filling station, but it's up to the client. Let's see what is, is her final uh, name. It's only our suggestion, fish water filling station. So let's move on to the 3D portion of the 3D portion of the water station. I'm going to show you the 3D uh, view so you can uh, imagine what is what looks uh, what the replica st station looks like okay let's move on to the 3D version okay this is it this is the 3D uh, look like by the way you're watching with water process and engineering services if you have not yet subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and click the bell button for uh, notification welcome once again to water process and engineering services okay in this portion I'm going to show you the 3d 3d look right this is the 3d look this is the frontage this portion is the where the garage is uh, located you can see the all right this is the area uh, this is the garage area so this is where the where, this is where the this portion is facing facing the garage Okay, and I'm going to rotate this one so you can see the other side. Right, this is where this is the side that uh, where the road is located, the interior road. This is the interior. I'm talking about this this road, this road, an interior barangay road. Okay, this is where the portion is. Again, I'm going to show you the back portion still open at the back portion so this is the back portion to have an exit good exit All right. okay I'm going to show you the top portion this is the top portion guys uh, top view okay let's see that number huh? Right, this is the top top view okay this is the top view of uh, the uh, referring station okay. okay this is where basically the the three gooseneck is located and we have two provisions for the uh, zinc this zinc one is for the cleaning of the dirty Dirty bottles or the gallons, dirty gallons for that is uh, coming from the client, or should I say the the bottle that came into the roofing station. This is where the, the wastewater is located, and it has uh, it's not yet finished, guys. This has provision for the drain, and also this uh, drain here. So this is where the pipe of the uh, wastewater is located or the tap water and the backwash pipe provision and this portion is has the uh, also a drain and uh, the waste oh, no it's not the wastewater this is where the 
purified water power wash is uh, located okay by the way once again welcome to water process and engineering service please love, li like and subscribe to our channel if you have not yet subscribed to our channel okay let's continue this is the tank where the tank is located the product tank and the uh, uh, road tank and this is the machine area so basically this portion is the production area and this is the cashier's booth or serves as the uh, office okay i'm going to show you the frontage of this one okay okay this is the glass portion of the pan uh, and the, it is covered to for protection for covid okay it has a circle so that you can uh, communicate and it has a small slot for an opening for the for the money you're going to pay the what you are ordering okay so basically this is the cashier's booth with okay i want to show you with the uh, with the view to the see with the view to the production area so that the the manager the owner can view the area okay this is it see this is the this is the uh three goose next this is where the uh releasing of the products with purified water and the owner or the manager has a view so he, so he or she can monitor the what is happening inside the production area and uh, before the attendant if you have two attendants that you, that uh, is assigned to this water filling station we have a provision for the dressing room so according to the DOH the attendant must uh, change whatever is he or she is wearing outside and this is the dressing room it's not yet finished guys and this is the storage area okay this is the storage area dressing room storage area and this is the exit area so this is only the entrance it's a bit this is a huge entrance guys it is a 1.4 meters with a standard of 2.1 uh, height uh, swing type door so that you can uh, uh, the, for example if you're going to if you're going to uh, in the future maintenance the tank that is inside we're going to clean this one or there's a problem or there's a leak that going to be repaired but that is a cell excuse me that is seldom happen you can easily remove the tank and be repaired outside for uh, just in case it has a warranty or going to repair outside for maintenance you can easily remove the tanks the machine without removing any parts of the water refilling station because if it's not uh, provided or it's not well planned some uh, w some water refilling stations are doing the demolitions in order to remove the what is inside so basically this is the bird's eye view of the interior look so, okay this is just a simple plan for the water filling station guy by the way you're watching with water process and engineering services right uh, talking about uh, how we assess our plan in the water filling station for our positive clients so we are here uh, from planning from planning up to the construction uh, just in case the client has no personnel or has no workforce going to assist them and uh, introduce our civil civil works uh, services 
So that's it right here on Water Process and Engineering Services. A video blog talks about how we uh, assist our client right here on Water Process and Engineering Services. So that's uh, basically the uh, 3D animation, or uh, should I say 3D view. This is the front view, this is the side view. Oh, sorry. <laughs> This is the side view, this is the top view. Right side view facing from the interior road and the back portion. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching the video right here in Water Process and Engineering Services. If you haven't yet subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel and click the bell button. Uh, for you to have a notification for our incoming videos thanks for watching the video guys